welcome back into today's video all right uh i've been burning the midnight oil as a lot of you guys might notice i went back to daily uploads more productively and more precise than ever before and i want to preface this video by saying that the rep squad is the best squad um things have been going good i'm gonna do this video right now i just want to talk to you about uh, several different things mostly because uh, like I said, I've been staying up late, uh, getting videos out for you, and really paying attention and doing deep dives, and paying attention to the community in general. Uh, so, uh, in order to not post at like 5 a.m., I figured that uh, we'd have a little one-on-one -on -one time. So, the thing about it is, the rep squad means a lot to me, and... A lot of you guys try to mother me out there and I really appreciate it. We got a lot of moms in the rep squad. Uh, primarily the fan base, if I go by my analytics, says that it's uh, t uh, 20, 21 plus age. And I think that's interesting. A lot of uh, single mothers, a lot of mothers out there in general. And I just want to say thank you to my mothers out there. It's always good to have that motherly love. Um, throughout this video, I'm going to post up uh, some of my favorite quotes and things that's helped me uh, since I've been on YouTube, which I haven't been on YouTube that long. There's a lot of veterans out there that know a lot more about the platform than me, but I've learned, I've picked up some things so far. A lot of you guys, if you don't know, I started uh, February 20, 26th, 26th or 27th of 2017. So I've only been here that long, which is not very long comparatively to other creators in the platform. But um, one thing that I want to do, and I think this is important, is tell you guys a little bit about myself and let you know a little bit inside the mind of Rep. And uh, one way I feel like we can do that and connect is if I create like a principles thing. I, I really want to do that. I think that's really cool. Like a principle guidelines for the Rep squad because things can get very toxic on the internet very quickly and uh, I've never been about toxicity as you might have noticed if anybody makes a video about me if anybody uh, says any mean thing to me in the comment section more often than not I'm not a responder I just don't do that I say my piece and jump out uh, but I've noticed that uh, a lot of people like to defend me and I really appreciate it as I said got my moms out there um, but one of the things I want to uh, promote in the community is uh, to put out positivity into the world to uh, do not fight negativity with more negativity and that's one of the things I'm going to put on the principles thing I, I don't know how, how I'm going to like word it or anything but I feel like that is a really good idea put principles out for the community like guidelines and stuff like that but not guidelines I don't want to be like a, a strict teacher or something like that more like loosely chill just kind of like relaxed vibe very lo-fi we are one of the fastest growing communities on youtube that's a fact and i'm just extremely proud of each and every person in the rep squad having you guys here for me day in day out means a lot uh, since i started back like since i moved i moved into a new location um i can move from a toxic environment and now everything is in my life is like more positive and I just feel like I'm on the right track for the first time in a very long time. I tried to do it in my in the last place that I was at, but it just it was affecting me mentally. And uh, now I feel like I'm in a really good spot. So I'm going to be doing a lot. Of, I want to do a, a lot of really cool things. I have a lot of crazy ideas for like merch, uh, content. You're going to see a lot of different things. I'm going to be like blossoming into like this new type of creator i can feel it in my soul it's like coming you know it's like a thing one of the things that's helped me is like because there's not a guideline for anything on the internet like how to be a youtuber how to do things so one of the things that's helped me is that um i the negativity out there it, it affects me greatly you know it, who who doesn't it affect i know it's kind of crazy because it's like there's so many people in the world like billions and billions and billions and not everybody's going to get along with everybody and i completely respect and understand that but the thing about it is is uh, even if i do see negative comments it still it still hurts you know 
uh, and I just know that there's trolls out there and there's people that just do that in general and you're supposed to ignore them you know whatever you say what's to say whatever, whatever you say, bounces off glue something like that uh, that's butchered that one right there I learned this from a therapist where um, it, it, you see criticisms and you have to kind of weed sift through it and uh, like the masses always have a simple message like what I mean by that is um, in a blur of a thousand voices there is an underlying message and uh, I try to seek through out to understand the underlining but now on the surface a lot of things look like a uh, mumbo jumbo and just straight up uh, trolly hate but I always try to penetrate through that and figure out and understand like the mechanics of what the the masses are converted you know if you if you convert the masses into one uh, vocal point if, if that's possible and sometimes you can't and that's where you have to cut here's a good principle where you have to um, say to yourself does this piece of information better myself or the lives of others and if it does not let it go and if it does implement it it's a very simple uh, thing and if you so if you see a negative comment for example uh, think is that gonna help me or the lives of others no let it go simple as that um, even like it's like it goes back into the stuff that I, I greatly believe in po practice and positive thinking uh, law of attraction things like that wheeling things into existence so you can imagine the negative thought in your brain imagining it leaving floating away pushing away letting go it makes me sound like a crazy doesn't it but a lot of you guys want to know more about the concept of positive thinking and uh, at the beginning of the year I plan to uh, talk to you guys all about that but I got derailed a lot of uh, negativity in the background and in IRL um, so I'm gonna get back on that guy positive thinking is uh, thinking positive and this helps with a lot of different things like it's for example um, it's like playing the guitar I've made this comparison before um, you have to practice it a little bit each day and by practicing it a little bit each day you get better at it and better at it and better at it so think positive use positive I am words like I am awesome I am great I am humble I am th anything that you want to become better at and then by doing this positive thinking doing your daily affirmations and different things like that um, it's gonna it provoke the law of attraction so to speak which is like this universal like law a lot of people don't believe in it, a lot of people do I personally it's worked a lot for me uh, the the irony and the ironic things the crazy things that have happened uh, it's just beyond maybe I'll get into that in a story time or something like that but it gets crazy so law of attraction is a thing one of the things I've been talking about since I started this channel is that perfection is in perfection it's okay to mess up that's fine it's normal you have to make these mistakes to become a better person to become better in your craft to become better at anything so definitely don't be afraid to make mistakes if you want to become a youtuber do it uh, I encourage people uh, to make videos every single day and if they're not comfortable posting any of those videos don't the idea is to is to keep making videos become consistent the persistence of never giving up and the drive uh, after you did it for a month you, you'll get there at a point to where you, you turn record on the video and then it's not about do I look silly in front of the camera it's like oh here we go again we're on the grind let's just do this and it becomes natural and when you get that natural flow uh, in your videos you're able to just uh, relate more you, you stop trying to be something that you're not and you are yourself and that's the one thing that you have that no one else has and the greatest content that you can give to the world is being yourself other than that um, Another thing uh, I want to talk about as far as like the uh, values of the rep squad is that we're not better than anyone else. Don't be caught in ego. If uh, somebody uh, calls you out, you, you don't have to always uh, respond. You don't have to always uh, say, try to get the last word, try to win the arguments. Uh, sometimes you just let go, as I, was, as I say. Um, there's no need to be winning every single argument some people want to argue just to argue and that's that's on them but the rep squad we don't do that we try our best and that's all all I could ever ask of you guys is just try your best because that's what I do I, I get in front of this camera and I just try my best I don't I don't uh, claim to be uh, good at what I do I don't claim to be like the best at what I do uh, well I do claim one of the best communities on the platform but with that being said um, I feel like I, 
this is a decent video. I want to know uh, some things from you guys. I want to know, um, like any of your suggestions, any video topics that you want to hear me talk about, just reach out to me, reach out to me and I will respond. Give me 24 hours and I will respond to you. I, I, ask in the comment section, uh, the majority of my community, I know I have over a hundred thousand, uh, well over a hundred thousand. If you count all my social medias, uh, Snapchat, Facebook, uh, Discord. There's thousands and thousands of members in each of my social media, and uh, most of them have talked to me. I spend uh, several hours a day just responding to people because, uh, for me, and this is just me, uh, I started YouTube as a as a method to help me with depression after an accident that put me in a very 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 bad spot. Like, uh, uh, and. I, I fell in love with uh, making content and so I'm just trying to give back something that you give to me which is my life and that's why I'm so highly motivated that's why this means so much to me that's why I can do this day in and day out and not get burnt out or tired of it um, so if there's anything that you want to say to me say it to me uh, we're trying to get to 15,000 followers on Instagram I really want to get to 15,000 followers it would mean a lot to me um, go over there. We're going to do a big in-depth, I mean, a Q&A. I'm going to answer the hardest questions, like the most personal in-depth uh, questions that you could ask me. I will ask them when we hit 15,000 followers on Instagram. The reason that I'm building up my Instagram is because I'm fixing to dive hardcore into health and fitness content. I'm really excited to do that. I'm going to release fitness and health merch. There's a lot of things that I know in my mind that I can help you guys with and I'm really excited about that. So with that being said, and this is just blah 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 and don't forget your rep squad mugs.